Alright y'all, so now we're back and so we're going to check on it says Look at the game at the Shady Bell. Okay. My horse is lost. Oh well. Come on, new Clint Eastwood. Alright, we are here. I had to skip the whole part to the Travel all the way here due to copyrights and music. Hello? Anyone here? Search both the floors in the mansion and sign with the gang. Susan! Strauss, you here? Note. Dear Uncle Tacitus, I do so hope you enjoyed your vacation. Lucky you, leaving like that. And you always suggested you were too old for travel. I hope you and your hmm. friends enjoyed yourselves. Me and your grandnieces have decided to take a trip of our own, as the place has become so dreary and godforsaken in your absence. We have gone to visit relatives. From my daddy's side, you are not yet acquainted with them, hmm. in Lacay. A small village just north of Saint Denis. It's buggy and muggy, but apparently neither is too bad at this time of year. Please come see us when you can. Yours sincerely, Caroline. Well, thank you, darling niece Caroline. I guess I'm coming to see you in Lacay. Don't keep sending us back every day to search this oh. place. Quite clearly, isn't a gang about uh -oh. held up here. Someone is here. Look, those are fresh footprints. Looks like someone might be here right now. Sure, someone is here. There's always someone everywhere. Well, let's look around, then. see if we can find something for Mr. Milton. Mr. Milton? I'd like to find a poison snake for him. That's enough, Mr. Johns. You take Mr. Bunter and search around back. Mr. Orley. Oh, boy. Uh, gentlemen, be careful. All right, time for me to get out of here. Yep. Let's go. All right, let's get out of here. I know I want to kill them, but nah, not right this second. So, hopefully everyone's okay. So they should be here. Oh, that's them. Arthur! Arthur's here! Oh, Arthur! Oh, you're alive! Just about. <laughs> Come inside. Come on, it's raining. Oh. Hey. hey, everybody, look who's here. How y'all doing? Hey, old man, wake up. Hey, Arthur, they got John. Good to see you. Yeah, he got arrested. He ain't hung yet? Not yet. They moved him to Sisica. He's been working on a chain gang. Howdy. All right. It looks like everything, everybody's fine, except for John. But don't worry, we'll get him out here. Oh, look, who's 
How did you folks find each other? What happened? Can can somebody give me a cup of coffee or something? Was Mrs. Adler who saved us, Dutch? After the robbery in Saint Denis, she got us away from the camp before the Pinkertons turned up. Then Mrs. Adler and Mr. Smith drove away the degenerates of a living here. Mrs. Adler? Mm -hmm. Oh, you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. It's been real hard, Dutch. We we've been surviving, but only just. What we gonna do? Things have been tough. There ain't no doubt about that. Mm -hmm. I am gonna get us out of here. This ain't over. Ain't none of you folks interested in our adventures? Guess we're more <laughs> interested in escaping the hangmen on our tail? Cheerful nymph of the prairie, wasn't you, Abigail? Oh, sure. My fair heart jumps for joy when I set eyes on you, Micah. <laughs> we buried Hosea Dutch. Charles and I stole his body from the law one night and gave him a proper burial. It was real nice. Hmm. Well, here you is. Well, I asked everyone I could find, and eventually someone new said you fools were out here. Shit. Give me a drink or something. Get your own damn drink. <laughs> Absence, Mrs. Adler here has been looking after things. Now sit down. This is Agent Milton with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Already. Uh, uh. Give them to a count of five and give them everything. Actually, let them have it. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh. My old pistol's back. All right. Where are we going? This way. There's a trap door into the other house. We can try to flank them. Come on, follow me. Where are you going to run to now? Are we waiting for the Take the other side. Mm. I will show strength, and you may mistake it for brutality. There is no escape for any of you. I shall hunt you to the end of the earth and the end of time. I killed your friends. Really start to irritate me. Take down and then. Gotcha. Gotcha. There's more of them. Get on that Gatling gun, Arthur. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ah, 
Say hello to my little friend. No! Yeah. Ah, oh, we did it. Saved us, Art. Oh man, Bill and Sadie. <coughs> you okay, son? Mm-hmm. Oh, we ain't been back for more than a few days. What? Well, what do we do, Dutch? Clearly, we need to leave. It'll take them some time to regroup. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, start packing up. Javier, you and Bill, get out of here. Go scare off any scum still loitering about. We need a couple of days. Now, please, gentlemen. Sorry. What next, Dutch? We just need some time. I just, I, I need some time. Now, we can't go east. This end will be in the ocean, so we're gonna have to go north, I guess. Might just need somebody to buy me some... Goddamn time, one of you. You'll figure it out, boss. You always do. What are you gonna do about John, Dutch? John? He's in jail. We'll, we'll get him. Abigail, just not not yet. There's talk of hanging him. It's not gonna come to that. Dutch! Not now, Miss I. Not now. I'm begging you to. They're gonna hang him. Break my The boys are. No problem. We'll get him. Okay, I'm gonna go figure out how we rescue this bastard. No. Yes, now. Give me a Doyle's Tavern, a million rapper. Gotcha. Okay. No problem. Huh, man. That was relief. That was intense. <laughs> so cool, I can use a Gatling gun. Stretching, sorry. My lord, what a goddamn mess. Yep. Not sure what happens next. Thing had been hard on all of us. Most of all on Dutch, who seems half crazed by all we gone through. All right, mission complete. So we're gonna meet the. Well, we'll do Dutch later. Right now, we're gonna meet Sadie. Uh oh, John? I mean, uh, Arthur? Oh, what the heck? I'm stopping for some odd reason. Oh no. No one helping me? Oh my gosh, no one even helped me out. Really? What the heck? Oh, 
Dude. He's dying. Are you heading there, friend? Go on. A folk on the road. In the road. Any help, woman? I'm sick. <laughs> I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> and that's Dr. Mr. You. I'm sorry. I was guilty. Well, friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let do uh, Sure. Thank you. Now, uh. wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them and coughing. Is there any blood? Sometimes. Uh -huh. Okay, now here. Breathe. Again. Oh, gosh. John, uh, Arthur doesn't look so good. Let me see your tongue. Now say ah. Not good news. I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. What do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. And you'll be. Well, the best thing is rest. Getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure. I can just take my winters in my country club. In California. No. Uh. Well. Like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Yeah, but wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Now this disease is very rare. I've been hearing <laughs> this is something that affected your lungs and stuff. Right now I'm just looking to Google about it. We can't change what's done. We can only move on. You have it in you, I can tell. So there's personally no requirement treatment on this disease that Arthur has. <laughs> Basically, I look at the Google. Basically, pains area in the chest, pains, circumstances can occur with breathing, coughing, can be chronic, chronic or with blood. The whole body chills. Red glue, fever, loss, blah, 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 sweat, night sweat or sweaty. Oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I'm just looking at. Also, content. Also, loss of muscles, blah, 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 weight loss, 
shortness, breathing, swelling. <clears throat> yeah, this disease is like, wow. All right, now I'm back on track. So let's go find, there we go. Problems coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now, yeah. What happened in um... Guama? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? Cause he seems. I don't know. Seems as. What began happening in Blackwater began happening years ago, maybe. A slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. I do. And Hosea? So that too. Hell, we got Lenny's body out as well the morgue and bury them together. Follow me. Got it. Let's go. Yeah, that disease are yeah, there's that Arthur has is like no requirement of cure or anything of this treatment. This is really rare. If you don't know what it is, uh go Google it. I'm sure you'll find that out. What's your plan? <laughs> well, I figure before we do anything we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. <laughs> John and I, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. Mm. Now the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. Whole thing hit folks real hard. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well. Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. Mm. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. She a beauty, ain't she? Yeah. On the ground, yes. Let's go. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Bullard. Ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullet. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, an Icarus would have made it across the sea. <laughs> you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Where is she? All right. Ah. Women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? We can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. I thought everyone knew about that. Why, a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above. <laughs> or below. Ah. Where'd you find this guy? I told you you two would get on. Uh, are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs., let us away. Wish us luck. All right. I've only crashed twice. Now, pull on that rope. And hope for the best. Ah. Okay. You boys have fun. How did you get out of this? <laughs> up, up and away. This is kind of cool. Right. Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay. Okay. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. Ugh. 
decidedly harrowing experience. <laughs> Keep going, sir! We need to get up above the clouds! It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. Hmm. Looks nice. Nice view. So we're getting close to the place that Mrs. Adler is talking about. Author and Arturo, how perfect is this? My mother was a keen student of the Italian eight. My brother's called Baldassario, so you could say I got off lightly. Look, I'm trying to concentrate here. Look, British. There it is. Ah, that's better. Look, we can see for miles now. Did you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. Morgan? Not exactly. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket here that you're very welcome to. I think I'm all right, thank you. Recalling the uh, blue suits discussion. Well, just say the word. So, if I may ask, what got you interested in the pursuit of aviation? Uh, I didn't, exactly. Uh, Mrs. Adler thought she'd surprise me. Ah, a very nice woman. And no shrieking violet. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. Or is it, though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in the mental asylum? I did not, Mr. Bullard. Hmm. Okay, we're getting a little high now. See that building up ahead on the island? That's the infamous Sissica Penitentiary. Hmm. We shouldn't fly too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? Mr. Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Well, you want a happy customer, don't you? Look, this isn't funny now. What on earth are you doing? The guards are bound to spot us. Calm down. They won't care if we stay high enough. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? The poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. unusual relax mr bullard and take over and keep us well away i'll do my best this filly isn't the easiest to control you know should we uh 
think about heading back. Calm down, dude. The wind speed is picking up. We should stay at this altitude. It's heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. Here, God, shaking like a leaf. Okay. We're good. We're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. Good Lord, my heart is pounding. Hmm. That's life, is man. You're good. I know. Come on. Oh, got him in the head. They were cleared. Oh, dude.
Yeah, I know that. Gotcha, I got you, girl. There we go. All right. So either. Maybe. Oh, damn it! Look, there's more of them on the other side. They must have followed us. Get behind something. This ain't over yet. Yeah, I know that. These goddamn old Driscolls. You can't leave it for one day. Just kill these sons of bitches. I know. Got him. Yeah, he did it. I only left you an hour ago. You can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're gonna make sure of it. I we have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. Sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation's really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's gonna swing. I'm gonna make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes. Fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> From a state penitentiary? No, but from the fields, yes, that we can manage. 
Well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. Mm-hmm. Not behind bars. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a boat, a little one, and we'll sneak in and get him out of there. Got it. Maybe a copperhead landed. No problem. No problem. <laughs> yeah. I best to get out of here too. Mission complete.